Good morning, kindergarten, and welcome to today's writing lesson. Today, we are going to label the picture. That means that we are going to write the words that show what each part of the picture is, okay? The picture is of an animal. In this case, this animal is a bird. All right. You will find this paper inside your uh, writing folder. If not, you need to go to the school to pick up your paper of it, okay? The first thing I do is always the same. I take out my pencil and write my name. You notice when I hold my pencil, I hold it from the bottom close to where the lead is. Today, I am going to write Alana's name. Alana is a student in our class. Alana is uppercase A, L, A, N, N, A, H, Alana. <clears throat> now we said that this animal is a bird. So here the first question is what am I? A bird. Bird is skyline, bubble at the airplane line, B, I, R, D. Bird. What am I? I am a bird. Okay. Now, we have to figure out, we're going to use these words, words to use. We're going to use beak, egg, tail, eye, nest, and feathers. Let's start with this one. This part of the bird is the eye. This one. Eye. I is E Y E. E Y E. I. Okay, and we're going to come over here. This part of the bird, labeling this bird, is the beak. The beak is like the mouth. Okay. Beak. B. E A K B E A K Beak. So we have three words. We have one am I, I'm a bird, we have I, and we have beak. Next, just like a doggy has a tail, a bird has a tail. Tail. T A I L. T A I L. Tail. Okay. Now, we have three words left, egg, nest, and feathers. I know for sure that these are the eggs, so I'm gonna draw egg first. Egg, E-G-G, -G. egg. E-G-G, -G. egg. I have two words left. I have nest and feathers. I know that the nest holds the egg, so I'm gonna write nest next. Nest, N-E-S-T, N-E-S-T, nest. Finally, the biggest word, feathers. Feathers is the part that covers basically the whole bird, right there, the feathers. F E A T 
H E R S. Now you notice since this is such a big word, I had to write this word, the letters, much smaller. See how big that word is? F E A T H E R S. Feathers. There's more than one. Okay? Now, I'm going to hold this above here, so if you need to pause this activity to complete it, you can. Now, we've been talking a lot about purposeful coloring. I'm going to show you a picture of what this activity's colors should look like. So your bird, this kind of bird, needs to have a red part that covers its eye. This bird needs to be brown. Her beak needs to be black. Her nest is brown and her eggs are blue. Now, this kind of bird, I think, is a lot like the birds that I see outside. And these, I think, are little finches. Can you see them out there? I'll see if I can zoom them in so you can see these little birds. There they are. These little birds have blue eggs and I've seen quite a few of their nests in my tree. They live around my yard a lot. So they're a bird. They have a feather, feathers. They have a beak. They have a tail. They have nest, egg, and they have little itty bitty eyes. Okay. So the colors blue, brown, and red, and black. And here is the words.